WABG, the Delta's leading news source. Hello and welcome to the ABC 6 News webcast. Well, town hall meetings by the Mississippi Department of Education continue this week in Bolivar County. At issue, the consolidation of the county's six school districts into three in coherence with the passage last legislative session of Senate Bill 2760. A West Bolivar High School, the site of Monday night's meeting where officials from the State Department of Education and the Justice Department on hand to answer questions and provide information on the new West Bolivar School District, now incorporating Benoit, Shaw, and the West Bolivar School Districts into one. The consolidation will, be will become fully effective and implemented by the 2014 school year. 2760 requires the administrative consolidation uh, in Bolivar County. We're going from five existing school districts down to two. We're here to get public input on how it is that we draw the new school board member district lines. Uh, this is the responsibility of the Mississippi Department of Education. So we are here getting public input on where those new lines need to be drawn. Senate Bill 2760 was passed without input from the citizens of Bolivar County. With even, even without input from our local representatives. Yes, uh, with our communities here, you know, we'd like to make sure that we do be able to come together on whatever decisions we make. But at the same time, in making these decisions or drawing the lines, we need to have material and paperwork, facts, figures all together so that we can decide how to draw the lines so that we have good representation and equal representation for our school boards. After, here, after this meeting tonight, uh, I don't think my small town or Buell would get fair representation. The New West Bolivar School District will take in the city of Rosedale and Shaw, along with the towns of Gunnison, Beulah, Benoit, Pace, Malvina, Choctaw, and the Lamont and Longshot communities. Other school town hall meetings will be held this week. As you can see on your screen, the public is invited to come and comment so the State Department of Education can come up with a final school district map. Well, staying in Rosedale, where Yancey Porter of MississippiScout.com says Rosedale's Kayla Moore will hold a, quote, commitment press conference Friday morning at 10, with Porter saying Moore will choose between Ole Miss, Mississippi State, Alabama, and Vanderbilt. A betting man's money would have it to be on Ole Miss, whom Moore originally verbally committed to in the summer of 2011 before decommitting, later giving a verbal to Mississippi State. And finally, College Hoops Valley victorious over Alabama A&M Sunday. The Delta Devils' first win of the season, also the first career victory as a head coach for Chico Potts. But the Indianola native says it's his players he feels best for after Sunday's win. I mean, it, it was good. It was good. But I, I was more so, it felt better for me for them to get that. I mean, because I know, you know, that tough stretch, that tough preseason stretch that we went through, um, it's easy for kids to drop their heads, start being becoming discouraged or whatever because they're on 10 or 11, you know, starting conference play. But, you know, I was more so happy for them. I, my, my enjoyment to come later on pretty much after the season. That's why I look for my enjoyment. You've been watching the Delta's number one news source.